Now, as expected, local lawmakers similar to those on Capitol Hill are split down party lines when it comes to Mr. Trump's conviction. Democratic leaders argue the trial holds someone accountable in a court of law, while GOP lawmakers express their support for the former president and call the trial unfair. Michigan U.S. Senator Gary Peters tells Six News the justice system, quote, played out fairly. He believes the jury was impartial when making the decision to convict Mr. Trump. Senator Peters added that no one is above the law, even including a former president. However, many Michigan Republicans, including Congressman Tim Wahlberg, are already casting doubts about the verdict. I think this will be seen by the fair-minded Republicans and independents as a vendetta attempting to keep a candidate off the ballot uh, who will, will most likely win. The congressman believes the jury's decision targets Mr. Trump's presidential candidacy and will cause doubts for voters in the upcoming presidential election. Six News continues to learn more about the impact of this historic trial and verdict. We'll continue following this story, including any appeals, the former president sentencing in July, and any new developments in the race for the White House. Stay with Six News, your local election headquarters, on air, online, and on our Six News app.